Greetings, programs. I'm Young Napoleon, and I want to welcome you back to my Hearts of Iron 4 Let's Play series. This is episode 22 of an attempt to reform the Holy Roman Empire with Nomaz and all of the DLC. In the last episode, we did some cleanup, making some progress here towards various borders. We got a little bit of territory here that I think we want to move into once these guys get into place. Because Italy is sure not doing anything. Uh, and then uh, we're cleaning up over here. We're probably going to end up having to take all of Spain and this territory down in here. And we're justifying on Luxembourg. And we also want to improve our tank design. While the tanks are kind of sitting there not doing anything, uh, I want to I want to improve their design a little bit. Uh, let's see. I'm trying. I'm trying to find a way to keep this open. Here we go, in one window, so that I can come over here. Yes. Okay. Very good. Okay, and so I can compare things. Let's see, picking up where we left off last episode, we know we like the gas, we know we like the welded, and we like the Christy. Uh, I can't remember... Oh yeah, I forgot about all these. You can like award medals and stuff. I should be doing that. That sounds fun. <laughs> um, okay. I can't, I still can't see the, the tank itself. And this is showing me the whole division, right? Yeah. That's not quite what I want. Alright, that's not going to do anything for me. Fine. We'll just come in here and... If I hover over this, will it tell me what I want to know? Nope. Alright. Uh, oh, you know what? Let's come... I think it was the Panzer III. Let's create variant real quick. I guess she gotta get a feel for what we've got here. Five engine, one armor. We've got wet ammunition, armor skirts, small cannon, basic radio, two man turret with a improved with an improved small cannon. Okay. Can I, can I remember all that? Okay. The two-man turret, improved small cannon. That's that's the main one right there. Two-man turret with a... It was an improved small cannon. Okay, now we do have improved radio, so that's good. Uh, was it a heavy machine gun or a small cannon? Dang it. Well, I know I also had... Oh, I had wet armor storage. I had armor skirts. Alright, so we'll come back to that. Oh, and I think our engine was at 5, and our armor was at 1. Our reliability is way over, so let's go ahead and bump you up to... Oh, we want the fix the speed. That was... We want to keep the speed at 8. We can't go any lower. All right, we're using, what have we got here? Improved small cannon. Soft attack over hard. Piercing goes down. So let's look at the heavy armaments, shall we? Basic heavy cannon, what does that do for us? 
covers the reliability and the speed, adds a whole lot of resource goods to the chromium and tungsten on top of the... This is going to go away if I try and look at... It's not. Okay, good. I've got two chromium, one tungsten. So yeah, I don't want to do anything that's going to force me to, to use a lot of that. Uh, okay, so we're going to stay away from the basic heavy cannon right now. We've got medium armaments, okay. Which is that adds tungsten, and that adds tungsten. Yeah, we just, we've got to have to stick with the... Let's see, what does this do for me? That shifts, that takes away... High velocity tank destroyer, okay. Alright, so we're gonna stick with the improved small cannon for right now. Secondary turret. Heavy machine gun just gives us some soft attack. This gives us more soft attack. Breakthrough, hard attack, and lowers the reliability, which is already ridiculously high. So we'll go for that. Gosh, I'd really like to... We didn't keep the Christie. Why not? Take the Christie. Take the Wielded. There we go. That's looking a little better. Uh, let's go ahead and give it a little more armor. Yeah, that Christie suspension made a world of difference. Let's see, so production cost goes up to 16.8 versus, oh hey, I can look at the numbers here. Finally, I figured out how to, okay. So the production cost does go up a little bit by two. Uh, and for that production cost, we're increasing the Let's see, soft attack stays the same, as does the hard attacks. Max speed goes up. I didn't realize I had lost speed on that. I thought I was at 8. Um, the armor goes up quite a bit. Piercing goes up, does not go up, rather. Liability is a massive bump, unnecessary, unnecessarily. Uh, fuel usage is about the same. Where's the breakthrough? 27 versus 51. Wow. A breakthrough is nice. That's the, the defense for... Okay. Alright, I like this. This is good. Alright. So, we... Let's see, this is... 35, down to 30. Uh, we'll keep this on 5 to just be producing something while these guys are trying to recuperate. But then, uh, yeah, eventually... Oh, I don't like the picture. Dang it. Oh, man. Oh, poop, that's not what I wanted to do. Lame. Use best match. Fine, whatever. We'll go with that for now. Um, <laughs> looks a little silly, but whatever. I guess it's because I got the, the small cannon on there. Alright, we're going to unpause because we're halfway through this episode. So we're going to let those get... Excuse me. You know what I should do? 
Let's make sure that these will use improved medium tank chassis. Okay, it will use the new stuff, I think. Uh, okay, let's see. Doctrine's available. This is Air Doctrine, which I'm saving up to build airplanes. These guys, oh, we've got troops that are unassigned. Nice. Okay, do not know what to do with you guys yet. <laughs> Excuse me. Two, three, four. We'll assign you to an army at least for now. Uh, let's see. Okay, so the third is lined up well. Oh, the. What are you guys doing? Okay. Are we at war with you? We are not. Alright, what to do with these guys now? I think I'm at a point where... Okay. We should... get Belgium knocked out quickly if we can. And get going up there. the Turkish Socialist Republic. We just need to knock Greece out. I don't think we really need any of their territory. But I would like to knock them out of the war. The Republic Social Italiana is in a faction with Japan. Free France. Dad gummit. How does this keep going back and forth is what I want to know. What's going on here? Then let's get Rommel. Catholic Mexico declared war on Panama. Panama. Oh, oh, oh. Honduras joined allies. I'm not... <clears throat> Why is Honduras joining the allies? What's going on here? German Empire... Okay, did something happen? Did they peace out? No, I think they're still at war. I wanted I did want to move down here. Carlos Spain has called Honduras. Okay, Peru joined Hispanic allies. That's nice. We got a research slot. Let's uh Engines, heavy machine guns. Yeah, let's get something nice and short. Oh, you know what? Might as well pick up some research speed boost, right? I mean, for all of the fact that I don't know what to do with all this extra research. 
Uh, okay, so what's going on? We're declaring on Luxembourg. <clears throat> They've got their independence is guaranteed by the United Kingdom. That's fine. Okay, so that's taken care of. Let's split you in half. Okay, and we'll give you Brussels. <coughs> Control right click to select. Nope, that's not what I wanted to do. Oh, wait, maybe it is. Control right click. Yeah, yeah, okay. And we'll give you an offensive line for Brussels as well. And then let's go ahead and embargo in Japan. Justify war gold against them. Conquer. Wallony. Let that get let that get cooking. Uh Nicaragua joined the Allies. Catholic Mexico. Okay, I'm just watching for that big one for when the US gets involved. Uh, let's take these. And there's not a whole lot on this line. I should be moving a little faster here. Let you move in. Free France is called Nicaragua. Spying Czechoslovak Union is called Nicaragua. Panama joined allies. Fine. Alpine Confederation is called Panama. Improved infantry equipment. We've got troops over here that don't need to be there. Control right. Escape. Control right click. And control left click to assign them there. Delete that line. Is the third, do they have an aggressive? They do. Okay. That's fine. Let them knock out Greece. I think I'm at war with anybody else over here. We've got a research slot. November 22nd, let's go ahead. Construction speed and factory repair speed. It's just a little bit ahead of time, so we're okay with that. Efficiency cap. What's our, what are, what are our, uh, here we go. Cap's looking at, you're capped out, but I don't need you to make that. Improved artillery. I should probably get some more in here. Yeah, look at how much that's. Let's get some there. Improved anti-air. Doing okay. Improved light tanks. How are we doing on trucks? We're doing fine. But uh, we might want to get a few trains up and running. At least forget about the trains. Trucks are doing okay. Oh, where's my anti-air? I want to get more anti-air going so that I can get those on. Because I don't think I've got anti-air in my infantry division. I do not. I would like to get at least a support anti-air here. Just to help keep my normal infantry from getting... Or my actual airplanes from getting shredded so much. Uh, so what was that? Production. Yes. Let's get that up.
Okay, which one of these does anything improve the speed that I that I get to the cap? Because that's the one that I really want. I think that might be. Nope. Okay. I can get more factories. Efficiency retention and the base starts higher. Increase the. We're gonna go ahead and start working on that. <clears throat> Uh, okay, now what am I doing? Oh yeah, I'm letting these guys go. Letting these guys go. Costa Rica, it's fine. Dominican Republic join the Hispanic Alliance. Need to wet my whistle a little bit here. Actually, you know what? We've been recording for 21 minutes, so this is, I think, where we're going to call it for the day. I hope you guys have enjoyed that as much as I have. If you have, please be sure to do all that YouTube stuff. As always, I would take it as a kindness. And thanks again for sticking through all the way to the end of the video. It helps the YouTube algorithm magic do its thing uh, and get me more eyeballs. So I, I really appreciate that. Always remember, sometimes you win and sometimes you learn. And I'll see you guys next time.